Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. Here I have a great article for you guys from RCR Wireless. I will leave a link to it in the description so you guys can check it out. So in this video, we'll have a, I have a T-Mobile network update for you guys out of this article. And Verizon, of course, I'll make a separate video as well for an update for you guys. So in this, uh, in this article, they talk about T-Mobile small sales. That's a very hot topic. I see it in the comments a lot. A lot of people are saying, okay, T-Mobile is building towers. They have density on the towers. What about small sales? Are they going to do them? What's the whole story with the small sales? So here, I wanted to point out something for you guys. So it says in the article, T-Mobile US, which accounts for 50,000 of the 60,000 node backlog. So there's going to be a lot of small sales that are going to come online, I would say, throughout this year and next year and beyond for the T-Mobile network. Now, why is this so important? Why is this crucial for T-Mobile? It's it's not going to take a rocket scientist to figure this out. T-Mobile is going to have the leading market share in the top 100 urban markets. I think that's kind of a foregone conclusion if you look at how everything's going, how T-Mobile is growing. So they have to build a very robust and dense network along uh, along the macro grid. So in some areas where they can't build any other offloading when it comes to a tower, they have to start putting small cells to offload because there's going to be an immense amounts of traffic that T-Mobile will have to carry being the share leader in the top 100 markets. They are, they're already the share leader in the top 50. They're, they said they're closing in on 40% in the top 100. So eventually they're, they're going to get to leading share. That means a lot of traffic on the network. So it makes sense that they have, you know, a lot of small sales on backlog. So for Verizon, and I'll cover that in another video, they're going to build a lot of their small sales new. Those are going to be brand new small sales. T-Mobile is going to focus on co-locating with other small sales that are already built out today. So Crown Castle, of course, they have to they have to continue building their um, their small sales, uh, you know, laying the fiber. So that's going to continue to happen. So they're going from five thousand to ten thousand, and then of course, throughout the next few years, twenty four, twenty five, they're gonna they're gonna start building more. But the good thing is, T-Mobile is getting on a lot of those small sales, so that's going to help their network tremendously. It's going to help them better offload. Uh, better optimize so across the board this is a great great addition to the network so i just wanted to share that with you guys this morning um, i'll leave a link to this article in the description i'll cover verizon in, in, in another video uh, probably do that one today as well so stay tuned for more like share subscribe and i will see y'all in the next one peace